Hi everyone, welcome back to the online tutor. So today I'm going to discuss a framework question, right? So this is as a revision uh, question, right? So this is the diagram they have provided us. So we have to find the, uh, all the stresses and the tensions in this uh, system, right? Okay, first of all, I we need to find the, uh, this uh, reaction forces right between the uh, these two wedges and the system right so I assume this is as R this is as S and R plus S will be 2W 4W right and the considering symmetrical behavior behavior R should be equal to S which is 2W, right? This is the first thing you should understand this system. R and S become equal, each R, 2W. And also we have to find the tensions and stresses in this system, right? So what I'm going to do, I'm just finding the <coughs> uh, Tension and thrust first, right? Using my secret method, so we can take this rod like uh, when you vertical up, then it will be thrust, and you put this way, and it become this way, right? And what else? This also mm, up down. And this way, okay. Uh, these are the forces, right? And actually, uh, this is a symmetrical system, so you can take this side, right. So the other side will be automatically come. And I put number one here, number two here, number three here, four, five. Right. So no need to take this side because these are symmetrical system. And I'm going to draw the stress diagram first. And right. So you know the stress diagram is like a, a scalar diagram, right? So the forces are indicate the distance. Right, the angle is also same. Actually, these angles are 60 degree, 60 degree, 60 degree. 1 to 2 is 2W. 1 to 2, 2W. 2 to 3, W. Two to three, it's down W. And here it's W and W. One to two, two to three. Right, and also one to five, it's going horizontally. One to five. And two to five, this way. 60 degree. 30 degrees. Right, so 1 to 5, 2 to 5 all are correct, and we have to put only 4. 5, 1, some angle, right? For 5, 4, some angle. And 4, 3 should be one line. 5, 4. Yeah, it should be this way. Five four and four three now call in. If you put uh, five four this way, four three cannot be call in here. Right, and this is sixty degree. This is also sixty degree. Thirty degree perpendicular W. W right okay now 
actually that's enough because other side automatically will come considering the symmetrical behavior of the system okay let's uh, draw the uh, table right so the table consisting uh, and the road name magnitude value and the tension of thrust so first I am going to take the first rod actually I didn't uh, put the name for this here is A, B, C and D, E so A, B rod B C rod, C D rod, D E rod, A E rod, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three, four, five, six, seven, B E, B E and B D. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, all are here. And the magnitude values, so this is W, this is also W, and 2 to 5, cos 30, which will be 2W, cos 30 is root, two, root 3 over 2, it's 4W over root 3, 2, 5, 2, 5, 25 in B Z D rod 4W over root 3 I think it's better to otherwise the, the uh, Actually, we can put the tensions and trust first. Here, this is tension B A B. What is A B? It's tension B Z. It's tension C D. It's trust and D E. We don't know anything about D E, but three for me. Four to three. 4 to 3 going this way and surely is trust trust what about A A E also trust what about B D B D 5 to 4 is up tension B D tension And last one B E. Uh, it's similar with the B D, right? Because the system is symmetric and tension. Okay, <clears throat> we have two trust and one, two, three, four tensions. Uh, three trust and four tensions. Right. So. Now 2, 5 is okay. What about the other numbers? 2, 5 and 5, 4. Yeah, 5, 4. But you know this is perpendicular. It's W. 5, 4. Cos 60, sin 60. Which is W. Sin 60 root 3 by 2. 5, 4 become 2, W over root 3. 5, 4. Five, what is 5, 4? 5 4 is our B D root 2 W over root 3. Okay, uh, one more. Uh, 
5 ok 5 2 ok and 1 5 this one what about 1 5 you know 1 5 tan 30 tan 30 equal 1 5 over 2 w this is root 3 2 w over root 3 1 5 1 5 it's our b0 right 2 w over root 3 b0 double k and what about 5 4 ah yeah we found it and all auto 3 4 this whole thing 1 to 5 we didn't find 1 to 5 right 1 to 5 ah, if I, ah. 1 to 5 is 2 w over root 3 and this one that uh, small this distance like is it is it like 4 5 cos 60 4 5 2 w root 3 2 w over root 3 into half w over root 3 is it when you add up these two 3 to 4 it will be 3 to 4 the bd dot will be uh, 3w over root 3 bd dot D -E. 3w over root 3 3w over root 3 ok so actually now uh, the other other the left side will be the uh, mirror image of the uh, right side so you can automatically write ae same for the dz right ae same for the dz ae and dz equal ae and dz 4w over root 3 ab equal to the bz 2w over root 3 and what about BE? BE same for the BD. BD 2W over root 3. Okay. So this is the uh, tensions and trust in the uh, given figure, the framework. So actually you can see my whole board is enough for discuss that sum. Right. So what I did, I found the uh, tension and trust using my secret method. Right. So actually without drawing the stress diagram, we can... Uh, find the tension and trust, right? But I'm not telling for all, but just at least. Uh, so here we have seven rods now. At least we can find three rods tension and trust without considering the uh, stress diagram, right? And this is the uh, tension trust, right? And after the taking the tension trust, right? And I'm, I draw the stress diagram. So I call. I told you this is a scalar diagram. But using the scalar diagram, we found. The, uh, distance of the stress diagram you know that the distance are equally uh, to the magnitude values because this is a uh, magnitude value the force is stress like the force are indicate the side of the stress diagram and using that we construct this uh, tension truss table and I put this data to the table and uh, here we are right so Right, so thank you very much for uh, watching this video, right, so this is actually uh, not a theoretical uh, video, right, this is just a revision video, right, so I uh, revise you how to uh, take the frameworks, right, how to uh, find the tension and trust in the framework, so this is my objective in this video, right, so if you have any doubt in uh, uh, frameworks so if you want to learn this again so call me contact me to the whatsapp number so i will prepare up online uh, session for you all right so thank you very much for uh, watching this uh, video have a nice day